I realized I'm a god. Think I heard a bit when I murder shit. In a moment, I'll be taking off a tourniquet. When I burn them and I hit them in the sternum, I don't even gotta enter, but I'm gonna win the tournament. That's what I'm all about. Alright guys, what's up? I'm just doing my Tears of Godless run here to start off episode, the next episode of the Iron Man series. Wow, I got like 1k XP there. That was awesome. That got me to 18 construction, so another two levels. Can now build arsenal air barrels and curtains. So, welcome to the next episode guys. Hope you guys enjoy. If you do, hit that like button, subscribe for more. And about to go do some questing because I'm about to bust out Swan Song so I can go start fishing some monkfish better xp so 16 more quests hyped it's about to go down guys see you guys when i complete a bunch of quests all right guys so to start the questing grind for uh, i need 107 quest points 100 for swan song and 107 for legends quest so i decided in order to start that i'm gonna go ahead and bust out all the free to play quests so here is me finishing black knight's fortress i believe everything is done yep three quest points very easy quest literally took me probably 10 minutes wasn't bad at all, but alright guys, so now I'm going to go ahead and move on to Demon Slayer. So, see you guys when that one's completed. Alright guys, so I'm coming in here finishing the, uh, what is this one? Demon Slayer. I just got to put in this, whatever, like, sentence this is. And then this quest will be done. And then I will be moving on to Dork's Quest. I That one, I don't know, sounds familiar, but I don't know if I've ever done it, actually. Actually, yeah, because I'm on main, I have, like, almost 200 quest points and all the free-to-play quests done. But, after this word, I got one more word to put in, which is Perche, and the demon should be done for. Let's check it out. From which she came, quest complete. There we go, boys. 90 quest points. I got six quest points and two quests. I'm telling you, these free-to-play quests are just awesome. So, that is now done, guys. So, I'm going to go ahead and do Dork's Quest now. So, I'll see you guys when that one's complete. Here is Dork's Quest being completed. No doubt, the easiest quest I've ever done in my life. Because I literally went to Varrock, got the 6 clay, 4 copper, 2 iron, came here, talked to him, said, okay, I'll grab the supplies, talked to him again, quest completed. And a free bronze pickaxe. And 1,300 mining XP. So, if you're just starting out, that'll get you like 10 mining or something like that. Not bad at all. Another quest completed. So now I'm going to go ahead and do Imp Catcher. I already have all the beads for it. I've had the beads since like the beginning of my account. So this should be a pretty easy quest as well. So see you guys when that one's completed. Alright, so now it's time to finish up, finish up the Imp Catcher. Give him all the beads. He's going to put them on his table and do whatever he does with them. And I'll actually get my Amulet of Accuracy. So I'm pretty sure you only get like one per account. And you get that from the quest. I mean, unless you buy it from the GE, obviously, but, like, on an Iron Man, that's the only one you're going to get. So that's pretty cool. But Imp Catcher is done, so I'm going to go ahead and move on to Pirate's Treasure, guys. I only have four more quests until all the free-to-play are completed. And then it's time to go back to the member quest. So I'll see you guys when Pirate's Treasure is completed. All right, now it's time to finish the Pirate's Treasure quest. Got to kill this gardener. All right, go ahead and dig. Dig a hole in the ground. You've completed the Pirate Treasure quest. Two quest points. His chest. And I can also use the Payfair option to go to and from Crumbs. That's pretty tight, though. The Payfair option. So now I don't got to freaking keep going through all the message logs and stuff like that. Open the chest. And we get a gold ring and an emerald. Not bad, guys. So, 94 quest points. Six more to go. I'm going to go ahead and bust out Prince Allies Rescue now. So, I'll see you guys after this quest is completed. What's up guys, so I decided to take a break from questing and decided to do some more fishing and I just got 63 fishing, nothing new, I'm about 12.5k from 63 cooking so I'm going to go ahead and keep doing this, um, it's really good for AFK like I've said in my past videos, I'm currently doing Slayer on my main as well, so if you guys want to see videos on my main as well, I can do a new series, I'm actually doing it right now but I'm not recording it but I can, it's um, I have a, I think it's a 5 mil start I started with. And I'm just doing Slayer to make money. And so far I've gained about, I want to say, 2 mil in one day just from Slayer. So if you guys want to see that series, leave a comment below. Let me know. But there's 63 Fishing, guys. I will be back once I get 63 cooking. What's up, guys? So I'm just coming in with the 63 cooking. I got about 5 more lobsters to cook. I really like these cooking gauntlets. Because if you see over here, I've cooked almost 200. And I've only burned six compared to when I was burning like seven or eight in inventory. 
so so worth it so there's 63 cooking guys i'll be back when i get the next fishing or cooking level whichever one's first most uh, i don't know we'll find out which one's first guys but see you then what's up guys so i'm just coming in here with 64 cooking finally my cooking has passed my fishing the cooking gauntlets definitely help with that so there's 64 cooking guys next inventory of lobsters i will get 64 fishing I cannot make baked potatoes with mushrooms and onion. No idea how good those are. Probably won't use them anytime soon. Or at all for that reason. But there's that, guys. I'll be back once I get 64 fishing. Alright, guys. So I'm about to be coming in with the fishing level, which is 64. I need, was it three more lobsters, I want to say? Three or four. And then after this, I'm probably going to move on. I want to say to fletching and woodcutting again just because it's it's such good money that I can't turn it down. And um, I did recently get one of those impling jars. So I've been hunting uh, nature implings because they get they give magic logs. And I don't have to grind 75 to do DT. I can just keep getting nature implings until I get the however many magic logs I need. But it's taken a little longer than expected. So I think I might just grind out 75. But there is 64 fishing, guys, so I'll be back once I get 65 cooking, which will probably be first. So, see you then. Alright, guys, so change your plans. I said stop fishing and cooking for right now and go ahead and finish these two quests so I can go ahead and do Swan Song. I just did Romeo and Juliet, and that got me five quest points. Super easy quest. And I'm pretty sure I just need one more quest point, so just to make sure. Swan Song, 100 quest points, that's one more. Other requirements. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and do a uh, sheep here now, and then I'll give me 100 quest points, and then I'll go ahead and do swang song, and then from then on, it's fishing monk fish throughout probably 99 fishings. Unless, well, I'll probably do sharks. I'm at like 85 or something like that, so I can catch them pretty fast. But till then, it's gonna be monk fish the whole way, guys. So see you guys once I finish sheep shear. I did it, guys. Oh, it is official. It is done. Quest is over with. I finally did Swan Song. Moving up in the fishing world. Monkfish from now on. Never have to go back to lobsters. Hyped. Now, the only thing that might take me back to lobsters is if I'm not catching these very fast and if I'm not cooking them very often. That is the only time that I'm going to be going back to uh, lobsters if need be. But there's all the things I got. Let's see if I got any stats up. Let's go ahead and skip through this. Let's hold down the space button to get through it fast enough. I know for a fact. Ooh, 10k fishing. Oh my. Oh, and 25k coins. Damn, that's good shit. All right, let's see what I got. Um, 45 prayer. Two prayer levels. That's always tight. And 75 combat. So there it is, guys. Quest is complete. Next quest I'll be doing is legends. Once I get these last two uh, herbore levels. Yep, two more, and then I'll be doing that after Underground Pass, of course. I'm pretty sure that gives me like four quest points, I want to say, three or four. So I'll do like two more quests, and then I'll be able to do it. But that is that, guys. So see you guys when I get the next cooking or fishing level. What's going on, guys? So I wasn't recording because I wasn't paying attention, but I did just get 65 fishing. Um, these monkfish, it's so much better than lobsters. I can just, It's just so much better. I can't even explain how much. So I got about 262 monkfish here i'm gonna go ahead and cook all these and see how many i burn and see what i don't sometimes cooking xp i get just an average of how many i'm gonna need for 70 cooking so i'll be back guys once i get the next cooking level probably or fishing level whichever one what's up everybody so still doing some fishing here and i'm one more monkfish away from getting 66 and there's 66 fishing guys 67 is coming up next and i decided to just instead of every level cooking the monkfish i'm going to get to like 67 or 68 fishing and then just go out and just cook them all at the uh what's that place called it's in birth rip underneath the bar it has like the unlimited fire right next to the bank so i'll use that place and just mass cook all the monkfish i get so i'll probably go to 68 stop cook see where that gets me i'll probably get 66 or 67 cooking from that hopefully so i will see you guys whenever i get 67 fishing what's up everybody so back again with 67 fishing one more monkfish left 
there it is I'm gonna go ahead and get one more fishing level and then I'm gonna go ahead and start cooking them all and see what level I get I'm already 6.6 K from um, 65 so hopefully I'll get 67 that'd be nice if I did because I averaged about 15% burnt when I cooked all the ones from 64 to 65 fishing so got about 1k in the bank right now just about with these add-on i'll probably have about 1200 1300 so that'll be nice to cook all those at one time so i'll be back guys once i get 68 uh fishing all right guys so i actually decided to stop fishing at 67 where i was at and go ahead and uh, cook all the monkfish that i have right now and i'm at about 900 right now um so i'm just gonna cook them and see what level i end up getting but coming in here now is 65 cooking See, oh, burnt that one. And there it is, 65 cooking. I think I can now boost it from 65 if I, like, do Gertrude's cat, get a cat, and then get the right uh, stew, I think it is, I'm pretty sure. I can get it, actually. So I'm going to look that up, and if I can, then I should be good to go and do Recipe for Disaster. I'm going to get these last herb lore levels, last two, and then I'll be doing a bunch of quests. I have to get 175 for Recipe for Disaster, so that's going to be a ton of questing in the upcoming episodes. But I'll be back, guys, once I get 66 cooking. All right, guys, so I'm just coming in here with the 66 cooking. One more left. I don't think the monkfish I have left will get me 67. I need, three, I need to cook 345, and I only have 356 left. There's no way in hell I'm going to be able to cook that many. If I do, it's going to be a miracle, guys. So I'm going to finish all these up, and then I'm going to head back to some more fishing, bust out 70 cooking. So I'll see you guys once I either get this cooking level or this fishing level. All right, guys. So I was a little late on recording, but I did just get 68 fishing, um, about 8.4K from 67 cooking. I can get that right now if I wanted to, but I'm going to go ahead and wait. <clears throat> I'm really surprised on how much I'm actually able to grind cooking because... I've never been able to grind cooking like this and fishing before just in general. But there's 68, guys. I need about 523 more monkfish for 69. So I will see you guys once I am 69 fishing. What's going on, guys? So I did just get 67 cooking. Three more levels until I can finally just be done cooking for a while. Until I obviously need more, need more food for Slayer. I'm about 378 more monkfish until 68. Um... I might get it, I might not, not too sure guys, but I am going to end episode 5 here, I hope you guys all enjoyed, if you did, hit that like button, subscribe for more guys, and episode 6 will probably be out in a week and a half, maybe a week, depending on um how fast I can get these next levels honestly, because I'm starting to get there where it takes a little longer per level, slowly for scaling wise, like I'm already 70 uh, wood cutting and coming up on 70 fishing and coming up on 70 cooking once i finish um this go ahead and finish these last cooking levels i'm gonna go ahead and jump to slayer again and start getting my combat stats up because i really need to get these up i'm slacking big time and my slayer is just disappointing i really need to get this the 72 for wyverns that's ultimate money right there that's just so much cash from wyverns and i'm like really excited when i get to that level guys so, I will see you guys on episode 6. Well, I realized I'm a god. Think I heard a bit when I murder shit. In a moment I'll be taking off a tourniquet. When I burn them and I hit them in the sternum, I don't even gotta enter, but I'm gonna win the tournament. That's what I'm all about.